Good morning. It is a Saturday morning and uh, I had my first week back teaching at school this past week. I am so tired. I forgot what it was like after a four and a half break from maternity leave in April and part of May into summer break. I am just pooped and Blaze has gone to a church men's retreat this weekend too. So I've got little Nevaeh and I have to take her into acute care today. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Um, I don't know if she has an infection or what's going on, but um, I'm not gonna share all the little details, but yeah, we live far enough away that I wouldn't just take her to the hospital or clinic um, because we don't have one that's open late, so I gotta go to acute care this morning here with her. But I'm not super worried because she's still acting very normal and eating well. So I, I'm just gonna take her in to make sure everything is okay, but I'll keep you updated as this vlog goes on. But um, it is 7.30, I already fed her her first feeding at six, and now I'm just making myself some coffee. Um, normally we have eggs for breakfast, but I don't know if I feel like making eggs or not. Um, I might just do some yogurt with some, um, fruit or granola on top or something like that. We'll see what I end up making and hopefully I can end up vlogging today depending on how the day goes. But I wanted to share with you another vlog because I know you guys enjoy seeing my day-to-day -day life and weekends are really only days that I can do this because I'm back at work now and I am not vlogging at school. That's not going to happen. So I decided to go with an egg and some spinach, squash and peppers from the garden and tomato from the garden, a little avocado and my coffee and then I might have banana with some peanut butter. I already had um, a little bit of cereal. I love snacking on cereal. I'm like a cereal addict. Um, I had some nuts with it too as well. I feel like I'm old already because I have this whole supplement regime that I take that I'm gonna fill my little canister for for the week. I take vitamin C, folic acid, um, vitamin D3, uh, probiotic, and then this is a natural acne supplement instead of like taking a topical or anything like that. It just, I broke out awful after I had Nevea, so that's been really nice and it's all natural in there, so. Um, yeah, I feel like I've got plenty of pills to take there. And I'm just gonna fill that up. So as you've seen in some other vlogs, I wipe down my sink about a couple times a week and then I'll wipe down the toilet I'll take out the garbage and by the way I am shedding so so much my hair is like it's just falling out every time every time I um touch it it just has hair fall out so um, that's post-pregnancy for you but yeah I'm gonna wipe down the bathroom here for about two minutes then I gotta go wash some green beans and then it'll be close to Nevaeh's feeding time and then we gotta go To put some squash in there but I didn't get a lot I didn't get a lot of beans just a handful really um it's close to the end of the season of these beans but I wanted to make sure I got them before they went bad you're at the acute care and we're just gonna head in and it's not like a check-in beforehand deal so I'm gonna check in and see how long we have to wait well the wait yeah. is pretty long they said there's some emergencies happening in the back so Nevaeh and I are just having a little conversation here talking while we wait 
Um, we'll probably end up feeding after your appointment here and then go to Walmart and hit up a few places or a few things that I need there. Um, <laughs> she's just watching me and we're talking a little bit. Can you see? Can you say hi, honey? <gasps> hi. <gasps> hi. Can you say hi? Oh, good job. <laughs> good job. Well, I found an apartment building, uh, garage, like citywide apartment building garage sale. Ooh, she's pooping. Okay, it's so exciting when you're a parent and your baby <laughs> finally poops. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm gonna check out what they've got. I don't usually shop at Walmart, but we're gonna see what I can find. Other fall flowers. These would make great DIYs. I love it. This burgundy is so pretty. I normally just walk around Walmart, but I am today. It's kind of fun. Um, I need to get home before Nevaeh eats, though. But she's still sleeping. My favorite section. Pretty good, right? So cute. There's some cute fall stuff. There. What's this say? Cute. These are really cute. Oh, this is really adorable. I wanted one of these baskets. Their t-shirts are $4.44 and they have some cute fall colors. I like those. Definitely gonna get one or two. Look who's awake. Hi, honey. Hi. And then I think I'll get a blue. There's some cute pants. Oof, that's harsh. Okay, well I'm just going to show you what I got from Walmart. We are back. Um, I did want to tell you, I'm sure some of you are wondering how Nevea was. Uh, she had blood in her stool last night in her poop, if you don't know what stool is. Um, and so I was a little concerned. I called in and they just wanted me to come in within the next 24 hours. So I took her in and supposedly the doctor said it was a fluke and it happened once. 
maybe she has dairy allergies i don't know and she had not pooped since she did in the car on the way home so i'll see what that looks like she's sleeping in the vehicle right now so i'm running in and out checking on her but she is okay she's content eating sleeping everything seems pretty normal so who knows doctor had no idea i'm glad it wasn't anything serious okay here's some things i got from walmart all right while i unpack this i'm gonna do this here so produce wise i got some whoa mushrooms some lettuce my husband's wanting to have salad a couple times a week so i bought some um, stuff for him i have more lettuce in the garden don't have mushrooms in the garden and i have carrots in the garden but i want to give them as long as possible to keep growing i have a cantaloupe here this was really good price i think it was like 98 cents or something like that um avocados they were 98 cents ginger i like to have that like make some ginger tea um let's see okay then i have sweet potatoes some apples like you heard me say i love apples um let's see oh then this giant 10 pound bag of chicken which i need to go take out to the deep freeze was um higher let me pull it out it was like 1850 or something like that and blaze said we should just cook up a bunch of chicken my sweet potatoes rolling all over the place. I'll get it out later. But cook up a bunch of chicken and have that in the fridge so he can do his salads. Okay, a couple other things. These are 50 cents. They're great. And Blaze loves tomato soup, so on lunches when he's home alone. And then cream of mushroom soup, 50 cents for making tuna casserole or something like that. All right, we like these. They probably aren't the best for you. They were a dollar for 10 singles. Blaze sometimes just needs a little flavor in his water. I guess I do too sometimes and it's good. Um, yeah, there is aspartame, but you know, it's not like we drink it every day. All right, and then Hunt's pasta sauce, a dollar. We love our, our tortilla chips. How to get some of those. Tuna is what, like 87 cents a can. And then we had to get shells because I was out of shells completely. Like what house does not have pasta in their <laughs> in their house? So that was what I got food wise. Um, okay, I was excited. This was like going to the Dollar Tree here because these beautiful little um, things <laughs> were a dollar. And then I just got maroon. Um, and so I thought that was really fun. And I kind of splurged and I was shopping the clothes at Walmart instead of garage sales. <laughs> this shirt, I'm excited. It looks huge. Now it looks huge now that I have it home. But I think it'll be great. It's supposed to be kind of more flowy, kind of more boxy looking. It has a tie on the bottom. Um, it was $7 on clearance. And we'll see, the medium might be too big because I'm no longer an 810 <laughs> after having Nevea. I'm a little bit smaller than I used to be. Um, and I got some of their V-neck shirts. Like, who can't pass up 444? I love thrifting, but you know, I just love plain, simple t-shirts. And normally I get them at Kohl's, but why not get them at Walmart when they're about the same price? And our school colors are purple, so I thought it'd be good to have one of those just to wear on Fridays with jean day. So that is what I got. I also found a couple pairs of pants at the garage sales I stopped at for Nevea. I'm gonna go check on her real quick and then I'll show you. All right, so here's the three pants I got for Nevea from the garage sale I stopped at. Um, one's just like a little blue jean and they look huge, but 12 months, she's in 912 clothes already and she's four months. And then one's just like a pink sweat pant with some little ruffle on the bottom and then some blue legging type pants because the daycare is a little bit cold that she goes to and I think pants would be good especially now that fall's coming like I said they're 50 cents a piece and I just paid the full 50 cents I just was kind of in a hurry and saw the cute girls clothes and that's perfect now my sister did give me some clothes but there weren't as many pants for that um, age range so these will be good to have 
Well, it's been a minute since I've talked to you. It's been several hours, actually. Went for a walk with a friend, gave him a bath, so I'm all wet now. And it'll be her feeding time, then a little playtime, and bedtime. So it's been a nice day. So I'm gonna turn my music off. Even though we went to acute care, I wasn't stressed about it, um, which was good, because I know a lot of first-time moms can. So don't, don't freak out, your baby sense that, just stay calm. Um, yeah, and it was nice to run some errands, go for a walk. Um, our house still really is not in great order, it's kind of in disarray, but I'll have time to clean that up. I'm not gonna stress about that either. And I um, just wanna enjoy my time with my little girl over the weekend since I'm back at work. And I have to brag, she rolled over for the first time today. So she rolled from her belly to her back. Um, she was doing some tummy time, so I was so proud of her. And I have to break, of course, just being a first time mom. You do get more done because I don't feel like I have to spend time with him then. So that's the only perk. And I do miss not having my husband. But I'm going to do all that. Um, I might not get as much done as I want. There's always stuff to do, but I'm getting tired. Um, it's been a full day already. A very productive, full, a lot of going, going, going Saturday. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did. If you haven't subscribed and you enjoy these type of videos, as well as videos on simple and thrifted living, DIYs, homemaking, and some motherhood, then subscribe. Alright, I hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. I'll talk with you in the next video. Bye.